All right, we are back on Sports Line, talking a lot about Vanderbilt baseball capturing the Super Regional yesterday, beating Stanford 12 to 5 to punch its ticket to the College World Series for the second time in school history. The Commodores will now face Louisville Saturday night at TD Ameritrade Park at 7 o'clock. The winner of that will get the winner of UC Irvine and Texas. The loser gets the loser of that game coming up then on Monday. So you have a day off between games in the College World Series in Omaha. It was an emotional day yesterday. Huge dog pile after getting that pop-up to third to end it. The Commodores headed back to Omaha. Here's Tim Corbin and a couple of his players right after the game yesterday. John Norwood, Dansby Swanson talking about the moment. Vanderbilt cashing in and heading back to the College World Series. Well, I'll be brief so you can get with the kids because they're, they're the ones who deserve it. But uh, I think first to congratulate Stanford. And I, I say that for a lot of different reasons, not just because we won, but uh, because of the road that they took to, to get here. It, it was not easy. That's a, that's a tough group. They had to do a lot of traveling the right during the exams. They had to come through Indiana, which was not easy at all. Uh, and obviously you witnessed a, a very resilient team that kept coming back and forth. Uh, plus they've also been the model for this program. And I say that with all due respect. That's a, that's a guy who's been doing this for 37 years. And when he won that game against California, the day after, two days after we had swept him, all he did was congratulate his former players and being, being old for why he won 1,500 games. But he's been the the trademark of, of what great role models in this game are all about. The kids, uh, just happy for the kids, uh, as always. Hayden Stone picked us up today in a huge way. Uh, the offense was was good. I'm happy for Johnny Norwood. It's why a kid like that comes to school and decides to come to school. Um, I'm just, you know, I, there's a lot of emotions, but I'm, I'm just happy for the group and happy for Vanderbilt University. Thank you, Coach. <coughs> Questions for the student athletes, if you raise your hand before asking the question. Thank you. John, yesterday, the guys who were in here talked about how they felt like, even though you lost, you built momentum with the way you came back in that game, and you had all the momentum coming into today. Did, did it feel like that, and is that what we saw in the first inning there? Oh, yeah. I mean, it, it, yesterday was tough, but, uh, you know, we keep sticking with one another and stay by side, and uh, we just keep passing the baton, you know. It's a new day, new game, so that's all we want to do is just win this game in front of our home crowd. Next question. Frustrating that you're the, the visiting team when you're the higher seed and you're at home and all that? Uh, yeah, it's kind of weird, but, you know, we stay with it. You know, it doesn't really matter. You know, we're still going to hit, and we're still going to have to pitch. So, at the end of the day, it's who, uh, who scores, and uh, we just leave it at that. In the first two games, uh, the team that fell behind early came back and either made it close or uh, tied it up. Did that help at all today once uh, Stanford started to come back after you went up early? Uh, well, you know, Stanford's a good team. They're going to hit. You know, you're not going to stop them from hitting. But it's uh, it's all about us. You know, I mean, me and Dan, we always say that jokingly. But, I mean, it's really, it's reality, you know. So we stay with one another, and uh, we just keep plugging away, you know. So if Stanford comes back, we're going to we're gonna score again ourselves. So just keep passing the baton to one another and uh, just never stop. Dave, could you just speak to the performance of Hayden today, coming in and picking you guys up there after a rough inning? Uh, he was unbelievable today, you know. Um, he's one of those guys that has, has a lot of confidence, and he was able to come out there and just throw strikes with all his pitches and, you know, put it where he wanted it. And, you know, we were able to make some plays behind him, but the way he was able to come out there and kind of slow them down so we could catch our breath and, and go back in there and hit and put up some more runs was, was huge. I um, can't speak, you know, volumes for, for how well he threw today. Sure. This is for both of you. <coughs> um, just kind of put it into words, what, what this means and how significant this is and just sort of your emotions right now. Uh, for me, myself, it's just amazing. You know, we're all truly blessed uh, just to be here right now with one another and uh, we just keep wanting to follow, you know, hopefully get a national championship. That's our next step, so we're not done. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely incredible because, you know, we started this way back in, in August with all the guys and, you know, we set ourselves out on a mission um, to – not, not necessarily to this point, but just to get better every day and, you know, become a family. And, uh, you know, at this point now, we're, we're the closest we've ever been. And, we, you know, we went, we went through some struggles, but we just stood our ground and stayed within, you know, one another and 
talk about today, you know, be side by side. We're all best friends and we're all brothers. And I, I couldn't be more proud of, of how we battled and, you know, went about our business because we just have so much faith in each other. And it's, it's a true blessing that we're able to come here together. For both players, after you left the SEC tournament, had that couple days off, did you ever imagine that you could put together two weeks like this and, and get to the College World Series? And what, if you did think that, why? Uh, I mean, sorry, Dens, no, but uh, we don't really think about the future. You know, we try to stay in the moment one game at a time. That's what Coach always tells us. So we just go off that. You know, it's great that we won, but back then we didn't, we weren't really thinking about it. We were trying to take one game at a time, one regional, and then super regional. And then, you know, now we're fortunate to be in Omaha. So. Absolutely. We, we have so much faith in, you know, one another that, you know, our, we have a great pitching staff and we knew that things were going to click. You know, it, we kind of looked at the positives of the SC tournament. Like, you know, we get a couple days to, to catch a breath and, you know, get back on our feet. And uh, it definitely helped out because we, we cracked down in practice and, you know, really focused and got in tune with one another. And, and it showed, you know, the past couple of weeks that, we, that when we uh, play good ball, we gives ourselves a chance to win. Two or three more questions here, Pastor. John, you guys seem to just be locked in today. You seem to know when to be aggressive, seem to know when to take. Uh, what was the key to, to tackling their pitching today? Uh, just be aggressive. That's what Coach told us in our meeting, and that's what we did today. Uh, so we try to, you know, everyone was just being aggressive, whether it's on the bases, whether it's in the batter's box or on the mound, you know. Hayden Stone came out and threw a gem today. I have nothing to say about that. You guys saw it. And uh, just caps off to him. I'm very proud of him. And Walker, you know, he stayed with it. Didn't have his best day, but he stayed with it, you know, back to picking each other up. So that's what we did. David up front. Anthony, you had the leadoff hit to start the game, and you're even pumping your fist going down to first. Do you consider that a very important at bat right off the bat? Absolutely. Um, just trying to come out there and set a tone, and uh, you know, kind of give the the parents that you know we're not going to fold down after what happened yesterday. And you know, I was lucky to put a good swing on a pretty good pitch and uh, get some things going for us. One more question for these student athletes. Thank you guys. Thank you very much for coming in.